Welcome back and today I'm going to talk about the New Zealand made Bob Sample Tank. The Bob Sample Tank was invented by Robert Bob Sample and was made in 1940 with no drops or blueprints in a railway workshop using local materials and resources on hand in an international harvested caterpillar tracked farm tractor. Three were made, the first tank costing £5,902 and the second and third together costing £4,323. Specifications The Bob Sample tank needed 6 to 8 crewmen to operate the tank and was armed with 6 7.7mm brand light machine guns and a 37mm cannon was proposed but never added to the tank. The tank's weight was 25.4 tons and was moved by a 6-cylinder diesel engine with a total of 127 horsepower at a maximum speed of 24 km an hour on road and it came with two fuel tanks at the front holding a total of 90 liters giving it an operational range of 160 kilometers. The tank's length was 4.2 meters, its width was 3.3 meters and its height was 3.65 meters. He served the Bob Sample tank. The tank had many problems and had a bad design. One of the biggest problems was that if the driver wanted to change gears, the whole tank needed to nearly stop to do so, and it was very top heavy, so any sudden turns would make it tip over to its side. The tank was built due to the ever growing fear that the Japanese will naval invade New Zealand, and also the English were running low on tanks themselves, so none, none were given to the New Zealanders for the defense of their country. The tank never saw combat, but did see the cheering crowds of the Commonwealth and was a huge moral boost during the war for the people of New Zealand, even though the media and the crowds disliked the design and made fun of the tank throughout the years. Bob Semple died on 31st of January 1955, aged 81 in New Plymouth, New Zealand. Thank you for watching and if you want to please subscribe and share the video and see you in the next one.